I have no idea what's going on here. Okay. How is this going on? Am I all alive? Is this even right? <laughs> and, oh, should I do it this way? Is this even right? Oh no, sorry, trying to see how this is working here. Okay. Did you change? I didn't change my. I don't even know. Oh God, no. Okay. That's wrong. The sassy thrift approach. <laughs> oh God, no. That's wrong. The sassy thrift approach. Oh God, no. Oh man. You see what I mean about this? Okay, no. Yeah, I think it was the volume. I had it up, up high on my phone. Let me just adjust a little bit more so that I could move this over, move my light over a bit. I got a new ring light, a bigger one this time. This is not supposed to say the sassy thrifter. It's supposed to say the sassy crafter. This is not supposed to say the sassy thrifter. I don't have two channels. I don't know how that happened. I actually used to have, I, I still do. I have a Poshmark account. So my Instagram was the sassy thrifter before I put the sassy crafter, before I changed it. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where my center is here and I have to move this. I'm sorry, guys. I've never done this before with this. I'm trying to move this out of the way so that you don't. I'm trying to get it straight. Hi, Miss Gigi. I'm, I'm adjusting here. This is um, happening live. <laughs> oh my God. You guys, thank you for hanging out. Hi. <laughs> oh Lord. You see, you see, I have issues. This is my first live on StreamYard, the live at, anyway. I did film uh, one time. So guys, thank you for being patient and I'm going to try to adjust this so you don't see the arm of my phone holder. <laughs> it is always the best, right? <laughs> and I want to make sure that you guys could see 
It's just missed to the camera. Okay, let me see something. Um, let me let me use this for reference. Oh, the arm is in the way. Okay, guys, I'm sorry. Just give me a minute. I want to move this arm piece out of the way. My Lord, help me. It's still in the way. Okay. Guys, just get, I'm sorry. Give me a second. I need to get my mic stand. Here we go. It's going to get rigged. Anyway, here, look, I'll show you what I'm doing <laughs> while I'm adjusting. <laughs> um, okay. I don't know why my camera's... Oh, that looks better. That looks a little bit better. All right, what do you think, guys? All right. Hopefully, I have enough. Uh, Thank you, thank you, Jen. Okay, good. Oh, this thing gives me anxiety. Okay. Thank you, Jen. Okay, good. This thing gives me anxiety. Okay. All right. Let's get. So I hope everybody's doing well. Um, I'm here coming from, <laughs> I'm coming from Jersey. <laughs> Probably should move over to the right. I don't know. Pretend I'm singing to you. That's easier than this. <laughs> that is so much easier. I did. I did want to do an unboxing real quick because I, again, I've been waiting for this thing. I know you guys know. Well, some of you know that I am obsessed with tea. So. Look at this just got today just got it today another order I know Jen um, I'm obsessed look at look how cute cute this is this is a straw but it, it uh, strains your tea I know I got one. I ordered two of these and they forgot to put another one in. So I had to call them. And I, uh, 
I ordered one for my girlfriend because she passed her test. She was taking an exam today. And she told me that she wanted one of these, which was the chai. So I got one for her and I got her a spoon to go with it. So she doesn't have to worry about straining her tea, even though I bought her a cup a while back. But, but this is, this is mine. I ordered this for myself. Oh, English box of chocolate. Really? I'm trying to make this a little bit higher. Sorry, guys. So annoying. <laughs> All right. So I ordered this for myself because, because just because, because I don't have enough tea strainers and whatnot. I didn't even open it. Look at this. <laughs> I'm going to have to try the, the chocolate one by Black Magic. How? Oh my God. Comes with the strainer. Heavy duty. Yeah, this glass is nice and solid. Beautiful. All right. Okay, let's get to crafting. I just needed to show my uh, my tea obsession. Right? Isn't it adorable? Magic Hour. It's called Club Magic Hour. And they have organic fair trade teas. Wonderful. I'm in love. I mean, look at this spoon. This is like a queen, like you're a queen. You're a queen sipping your tea. I'm just going to sip my tea. <laughs> you know that meme? You know, the gossip? I'm literally going to sip my tea. <laughs> okay, let's get to crafting, guys. Anyway. <laughs> So last night I was thinking while I was up in bed at four o'clock in the morning, how am I going to use up all my scraps? And when I mean scraps, I mean like my fabrics and trim scraps, my paper scraps. Where are my paper scraps? Um, I have this, sorry, I just knocked this thing, full of papers that I need to use up. So if you can see, these are altered paper clips that I made. And that's the back. So stinking cute. So stinking cute. All right. So what I did was, if I could find it. Oh, Lord. All over the place. I used this. I used this punch. Oh, Jen, you have to. Yeah, you definitely had to step up your, uh, your game. Especially people coming from England. I was there years ago when I was 18. And you best believe I had to go hit up a tea, a tea house.
There goes that arm showing again. Oh my God, so annoying. Okay, anyway, I use this punch for my, I punched out all of my paper scraps. So as you can see, I was very busy last night. <laughs> very busy. Um, this is like leftover from the file folder from the Dollar Tree. There's a lot, a lot of things here. Uh, this is from an Artie Mays kit, her Bohemian Artie Mays kit when my printer was running out of ink. So I decided to do that. Yes. Yeah, so I have quite a lot here. This is from a tissue box. You know, the cardboard where they put the tissue in. Had that. Um, so let me see. Let me just grab a scrap so I can show you. I mean, you guys get the gist of it, but I'll just show you anyway. So here's some uh, Bohemian scraps from my Bohemian junk journal that I made. So pretty, right? That's it. I was just going to town. If you could use any punch guys or what you could do. You can make banners as well. So for instance, um, for example, actually, no, for instance, I made this. This was done. I made this years ago when I was into my happy planning, when I was busy with gigs. Now I can't, I don't have to plan anything because I don't have anything, but I was making um, the, the embellished paper clips so you can see what, they, what it looks like. I held on to this for a few years. So I was making all of these and hot glue gunning, hot, using the hot glue onto the paper clips. Do I, I'm not making any sense right now. <laughs> oh, thank you, Jen. Yeah, it's from a paper pad I got, I think at Michael's. Oh, this is not quite, that doesn't reach. Okay, can't use that one. This just makes it super easy. I totally forgot I had this punch. I have punches and they're away in a storage box because obviously as most of you know, I had to move back in with my parents and I'm in the basement and I have all of my belongings and some of my stuff is in bins. So I forget what I have. All right, so let's let's get to the embellish embellishing part. Let's see, what do I, which one do I want to use? Let's use the um, this one. Let's use this one. So I'm gonna use this as a backing. Oh, you could see this white arm again. Oh my god, so. <laughs> Yes, I got this on sale at, um, I think it was Hobby Lobby. Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, I'm messing with this because that arm is in the way. All right. 
Yeah, this was on sale. I never pay full price for my things. I wait and I just go on a bargain hunt all the time. So yeah, this is the tab punch. I don't think you could see because of the glare. I don't know how to get rid of the glare. My light is probably way too bright. All right, anyway. So you get the idea. You get the idea. And like I said, if you don't have a punch, you could always hand cut um, your own, like I did here. This was hand cut by me. And then you could embellish them like I did with this one. All right, so I'm gonna grab a paper clip. So easy, guys. Oh my God, I know, Jen. I know, I had this issue with the first video I, I shot and I was not happy. But um, my phone is like so full and I have to delete all of my social media apps and everything before I could actually export my iMovie video when I film my videos and then put it and then uh, uh, upload it into YouTube. So it's like a whole process. And I was like, let me just try to go live. But obviously it's not, it's not as clear. Anyway, I'm going to use my fancy glue because I don't know where my other glue is. A little room tour, girl. You want, you want a tour of my basement? I'm actually on my, I'm using my makeup table. This is my makeup table, guys, that I use. It's, I got it at the Hobby Lobby. It's really like a side table because it's, it's not as wide. It was perfect. And, um. So this is my makeup table and I had to move all everything. <laughs> I moved everything out of the way for my crafts. Oh, Jen, you should. When are you going to start recording and making your own videos? Yes. Yes, I know. So true. Even my iPad and I don't have anything. Um, my storage is a uh, bins. I have tons of bins. But because my boyfriend just bought me this Canon image class laser printer, it's taking up a lot of room and I have that on the table. And yeah, I have a lot of stuff because <laughs> I did, I had a downsize from owning a house and moving here, <laughs> you know, so that was pretty hard. That was hard. Maybe, maybe one day. I did paint down here. I painted it gray. And, um, you know, I try to make do, make do. It's humbling though, let me tell you. Ooh, I kind of like this. Yeah, I don't understand what's going on with the memory. I think with my iPad, um, because I use it for work, I use it for my lyrics. I have tons of music and tons of lyrics in it. And I can't get rid of it because it's like, that's what my boyfriend bought it for. He bought it for me so that I could, you know, use it for work. Can 
kind of like that. Anyway, oh, I forgot to punch the hole. I usually wait for it to kind of set a little bit. Yeah, I like gray because it's neutral and you could, I mean, I love grays, uh, teals, um, like that. Uh, not peach, but more like, yeah, I like peach too. I like peach, like, but dark peach, not like peach. You could, you could swap out the colors too. You know what I mean? Okay. I'm going to use my crop it out, a polka hoe right in between, um, right in, yeah, right in between here. Oh, I used a big hole. Oh, well, that's fine. And then, okay, so let's see. What am I going to embellish this? I kind of like this, but I want I want to put something else. Yeah, you could put any color, any color goes with gray, yellow, peach, teal, red. No, I, no, I was living with my daughter's father and that wasn't working out very well. Like we were living in, under the same roof for years. Like we weren't even together for about five years because of my daughter. And um, I finally, had, well, like we had to, you know, give up the house and everything and and I knew I had to have surgery. And so he's just not a very nice man. I needed to heal. So I had to ask to come back. <laughs> well, thanks. It's just like, it's a Tupperware. <laughs> Look at this mess, guys. Oh, I like this because this has like gold in there. So. You know, I'm just winging it here. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. No, I've, I've been, so I've been living here for about three years. I had to have a full hysterectomy. So that's why I'm here. I mean, you know, that was one of the reasons, like I said, I needed to heal without any stress. So... Oh, it's all right. It is what it is. It is what it is. No, that's too, it's too dark. Oh yeah, I have, look at this. I mean, I had to dump some of it out but I have so many scraps. I don't know what I'm doing. And then my stepmom was like, what's with all this stuff? She's like, you're a hoarder. I'm like, I can't throw it out. No, no way. There's a method to my madness. <laughs> she throws everything out. She Kind of, I want the blue in the back. I want something dark in the background, I think. No. I play around. I just play around, you know? But I really want to have this hanging here. It's like very boho-y. Unless I cut it. No, I like this here. Boho, bohemian. Yeah, pre-cancer. Yeah, I had those years ago. And then um, in, 2000, in 2008 or nine, I had a tumor on my right side of my stomach wall. And that was, um, it was benign, but it was huge. Don't know, it was called a desmoid tumor. I don't know, it's very weird. So that was my first surgery and that was, whew, that was something else. That was crazy. Cause they had to cut me open from top to bottom. And then when I found out that I had these huge um, fibroids, um, 
this huge fiber and made me look I was pregnant. At the time, I was singing with a, a entertainment company, and we had to like film a video, and I was not happy. I looked like I was pregnant because of this tumor, and so um, my uter they couldn't even get to my uterus to perform a biopsy because it just pushed it out of the way. And it was making me sick. My iron was very, very, very low. I had to get um, infusions. And so when I found that I was supposed to have surgery, I broke down and cried because I was like, uh, can I have it laparoscopic? And he was like, I can't, I'm sorry. It's way too big, so. So they cut me open in the same spot once again. And uh, not only did I have to have that surgery, but they had to repair the hernia from the other surgery because this tumor like, like pop, popped it. It's crazy. So I had two surgeries at the same time. Thank God I had really good doctors. That was something. That was something else. I'm using Fabri-Tac, by the way. <laughs> you guys want to know? It's all the way at the bottom. <laughs> so I'm using it to attach this. Oh, oh, Jen. My best friend right now, she's just went into surgery today to have a uh, breast reconstructive surgery. She um, had them both removed a few months ago. She's my childhood best friend. And um, yeah, she just had, they just did the, you know, they had to put the boobies in. And she's a thyroid survivor and also a heart attack survivor. It's crazy. Her first cancer, the thyroid cancer left her weak. Oh, thank you. What's your name? Attache Papers. <laughs> Yeah, it was it was crazy. That's a crazy experience. Um, and uh, my daughter's father wasn't very nice. He didn't the first surgery anyway. He just it was rough. I ha I had to go back to work within two months just so that I could keep my job. And yeah. Oh, okay, Tina. <laughs> Tina, Tina, nice to see ya. Nice to see ya. But this was the best decision I ever made because um, my boyfriend was my friend at the time. We were in a band together. He put me in his band and uh, he has been my rock ever since. He helped me move out. He believed in me. Oh, she said Don. <laughs> I need some bling in here somewhere, so. Vanessa, I'm so sorry. Yeah, my best friend, she had her heart attack in front of her students. She's um, She's a biology teacher. They had to revive her like three times, crazy. That's insane. I'm so sorry, but glad that you're here. I like that up there. That's going up there. It's going up there. Thank you. She lives in Florida. I've known her since, um, oh God, we've known each other since we were to toddlers. I used to live in Coney Island. I grew up in Coney Island in Brooklyn. And her grandfather was a cook in one of the schools and she would stay with her grandfather all summer. And spent we spent our, our summers together every summer. And so I've known her for that long.
these little bits. I mean, I'm going to have to do a lot of tags. <laughs> Look at all these bits. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I really need to go do that. Uh, I'm going to cut this off a little bit. I like that it hangs out. It's very shabby and... I'm going to, I think I'm going to glue this down a little bit. Wow. Absolutely. Women are strong. Let me tell you. Um, I'm 44. I'm 44. I'm 44 young. <laughs> Girl, I'm about to get Botox soon. <laughs> My girlfriend, um, Glory, I think I told you before, but she's a, she's an esthetician. And she works for Kate Somerville. So, like, I get the hookup. I haven't... I don't even have to pay for skincare, but, um, she just got a job. Well, she works for them as far as like selling and stuff like that. But now she works at the headquarters, the spa headquarters in Nordstrom in New York city. And so she has the discount for Botox and all that stuff. <laughs> so I'm like, I want to go like next week before this video shoot that I have on Friday. I need it. I need it. I wish I could like take the glare away. 40. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm getting up there. I'm getting up there. I want it. I just have this one, like this one deep in between my eyes from squinting. I wear glasses and contacts and I'm always, I always got the resting, you know, bitch face. <laughs> you know, growing up in Brooklyn, you got to look hard. <laughs> so nobody starts with you. <laughs> oh man. So. I feel like I need a pop of color or something here. So I'm going to treat myself. I deserve it. I deserve it. <laughs> I'm getting that injection, boy. It's going right in between my eyes. Hmm, do I have like a white lace that's skinny? I don't know if I should use the purple. I know, right? That is young. I feel like I should, you know what? I'm going to use some lace too with this. Okay. We're just going for it. That's all. We're just... This is winging it, guys. Winging it. I have no I, I don't I don't know what I'm doing. This is, you know. I just wish this was more centered. I could get this phone the right way and this light. It's not so much of a glare. But I feel like if I start messing with it then Oh my God, 30. Oh my God, so sorry. I haven't yet, no, I'm, I'm trying to, <laughs> oh Lord, I'm trying to save my money, even though that's not happening.
that color on the screen does not like do any of these things justice, but okay. <laughs> I said, okay, let me see something. No, I'm not feeling that. Did I just knock my phone? I'm gonna have to figure this lighting better next time. I don't know, but yeah, I'll buy her digitals. I'll buy them. I um, my printer, the cartridges are expensive. I just had to buy two of them, and there was seventy a piece. So I'm trying to be like really smart with what I print. All right, so that's one. I mean, I'm okay with that. I'll, I'll probably add to it, but, um, you know, it's fine. Hi, Tina, how are you? Tina loves to craft. Thank you for joining me. I'm making some altered paper clips, as you can see. Uh, let me move over here because, okay. I'm trying to see what it looks like on my uh, iPad from here. Let me move down. And then that's the back. And I'm using the scraps. All of my scrap, my scrap papers, and my puncher. My little tab puncher that I, that I have here. So um, that's what I'm doing. If you're just joining me. Yeah, so these are these are all the ones that I punched out last night. <laughs> and I came up with the idea. I'm sure someone else came up with this idea, but. Oh, that's cool, Vanessa, yeah. Okay, so we have that one. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Okay. Let's try another one. Let's try another one. Hoo, hoo, hoo. How about one of the, the bohemian ones? Because I do have to start a bohemian uh, junk journal for my girlfriend, Natasha. She's been waiting patiently. She gave me some stuff back in the summertime when her aunt moved. And she wanted me to use a few things of hers. So I'm going to use this pretty paisley, like gold, <clears throat> this good one. So I'm, so most of these papers are cardstock. So you want to use cardstock. I don't know if the thin paper is going to, I mean, you could back up thin paper. This is thin. This is copy paper um, from a wrapping, a vintage wrapping. So I'm going to try it later, but. I'm sure it'll warp a little bit, but you know. The craft, there's lots of Tina's in the crafty world. So yeah, I'm just gonna put the paper clip here. I wonder if there's a way to zoom. I don't know if there's a way to zoom. Let me see something. Oh, maybe not. Uh, no. Okay, never mind. <laughs> the sassy thrifter. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know why. I still don't know why it says a sassy thrifter. <laughs> Only me. Only me. I'm trying to stick with the sassy, you know, sassy soul singer. Sassy thrifter, sassy crafter. I actually sold something on Poshmark today. It's been a while. I haven't been uh, doing much with that, but I feel like paper is my calling. <laughs> Using my hands and creating things, that's always been my thing, even since I was a little girl, so... Thank you for your comment, Tina, on my video. Oh, 
Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't have does it have the reverse? Because I had to put my phone down. Like I had to make forward, like make it face down. You know what I mean. Like I can't check it. I can't check it right now. So And guys, these are so, these are, are like perfect. Like, let me show you something. I'll show you how cute this looks. So, oh, this is, like a template of a junk journal, a bohemian junk journal that I started for my girlfriend. So, um, how, look, I mean, look how cute. How, how cute is this? How cute does that look? Right? <laughs> so stinking cute. Oh, this one, this is from a paper pad. Um, I forgot which paper pad. Yeah, it's from a paper pad. I don't know, one of Hobby Lobby or Michaels. I'm always buying paper pads. All right. I mean, yeah, this is pretty simple, guys. But I thought it was stinking cute because I don't have embellishments. I'm always, my time is always so like I spend my time making embellishments as I'm like making my journal and I find myself taking forever. That's why it takes me like six months to finish a junk journal <laughs> because I'm just, you know, creating the things right there on the spot instead of having them all, you know, done. So that is me because just because. Oh, I could kind of cut this up. I made this little scrappy bohemian thingy snippet, but I never used it because um, my friend's journal was way too, it was already chunky enough. I couldn't fit anymore. This is some tool. Is this thing lagging now? Yeesh. No. Nope, 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 nope. Thank you. Okay. I am going to use this. Scraps from a 1980s dress that I got at the Goodwill. So do I, Tina. I jump back and forth as well. I get, I think I get bored easily. I don't know if it's the ADD or what. <laughs> I said I have craft ADD. Craft ADD. I need something else. That is me. My boyfriend yells at me. He's like, when are you going to just finish one thing? I'm like, I can't. Because I, I I get stuck and I got to do something else. And then I'll come back. Like, leave me alone. This is my process, okay? And he should know because he's an artist himself. He's, he's a singer-songwriter. <laughs> I'm like, go worry about yourself. I need something there. I got so much stuff here. It's crazy.
Oh, I think I like this better in the background. Oh, wait, hold up. I want this tool with the bling instead of that tool. You can't really see it. Oh, yes. I'm using this. So this is from a dress that I got at one of the thrift shops. They have like a rack of Indian clothes, Indian clothing and sari and stuff. And this was, this was the neck, I think, portion of the dress. It's so pretty. I like this bling on here, so I'm gonna use it. I'm going to use it. Use it or lose it. And I'll double up. I'll double up, I think. And you could see it a little bit, right? Up there. And oh, good night, Miss Gigi. I get it. I know. I know you're on the other side of the world. Thank you for tuning in, though. I really appreciate it. Guys, this is like my first YouTube live. So thank you so much. You know, we get lost in this huge uh, ocean of craft people, crafty people. So, you know, it. Uh, I appreciate you guys. Thank you. I'm pretty new at this stuff. I've only been doing this a couple of years and that's it. Like I've been, you know, watching videos and uh, doing my, you know, just taking notes. Thank you, Vanessa. All right, I, I feel like I'm covering up the bling. Maybe I should make this like smaller. Like just a little, like a little patch. Doesn't have to be perfect. Like seriously, it doesn't have to be perfect. Like I could do that and I'm fine with it. And guys, you could even use, you know what? You could even use a stapler. If you don't have glue, use a stapler and then you could cover up the staples with some kind of embellishment. You know, you have options. You have options. Just giving you options here. And then I could cover that up. Let me make my hole up here. My hole. I mean, I could really go the extra mile and put an eyelet too, but I'm not going to be fancy. Oh, Jen, look what I just found, Jen. <laughs> where, where is Leticia? Where is she? <laughs> the Brad. She did not know what a Brad was. Oh, my God. She had me cracking up last night. Like, that girl, she... <laughs> oh, my God. All right, so I'm looking for my stickers, my blingy stickers. Oh, man. Good night, Tina. Thank you for joining and tuning in. I really appreciate it. Where are my stickers? <laughs> Brads. Oh man, she had me laugh. That was so funny. Like I just had my stickers. Sorry guys, I'm just looking for my my little blingy stickers and I don't know where I put them. I moved them out of the way. I moved oh here it goes. Okay. I 
these stickers. Oh, I think the fuchsia. I don't know, I'm always, always drawn to those colors, like the rich jewel tone. The pink is nice. The pink. Let's see. I could do that. Yeah, I'll go with that. I could do that or add another piece of fabric. It's whatever you want to do, guys. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You know what? <clears throat> I got it. I really wish this was a lot clearer. StreamYard need they need to get their act together. Like seriously. They need to do something about this quality video because I'm not having it. I'm not having it. Oh, hopefully this will stick. I'm using the wrong glue, guys. I need to use Fabri Tac. <laughs> I'm all over the place. I'm all over the place. Sorry. I'm so used to grabbing that glue, you know, it's just like. Um, I. No, I wish I could go live straight from YouTube, but I only have 50 subscribers, which by the way, yay me, today I made 50. Maybe I should do a giveaway. <laughs> um, I, I don't know. I forgot how many you need, but I don't have that many to go live, I don't think. So, YouTube, you, you need to stop this nonsense. It's not nice for us little people. It's not very nice. You gotta give us like this limit. It's not fair at all. It's not fair. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> I how many subscribers do you need? Do you need I don't know if it's God, I forgot. I don't wanna say it and be wrong. A thousand. Yep. There you go. Yep. Well, <laughs> 950 short. <laughs> I'm 950 subscribers short, guys. You want to help me out? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh man, that's funny. Let's use this trim here. We're gonna go with this trim. <laughs> I need a rally, I need to rally. Wow, nine years? Oh God, I'm, damn. I'm gonna be in a wheelchair by the time I get a thousand subscribers. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> Cute. 
These are so cute. I love them. Oh no. Look what I did. Oh boy. I stapled like it was per it went it perfectly. It stapled the um the paper clip. Well, you can't even see because the glare. I'm sorry guys, you can't even see it, but it caught the paper clip. So now I have to move it. <laughs> I think I could use these things here. My pliers. How did that happen? Well, next time I have to pay attention, I guess, right? I'm gonna have to um cut that. <laughs> oh man. Always something. <laughs> I'll just snip it. It's all right. All right. All right. Thank God for my pliers, my little jewelry making pliers. I got to start making some more boho beads and stuff like that. <laughs> Thanks, Tina. I try. I try. Not me. I'm not the troublemaker. Never. Believe it or not, I used to be super shy when I was little. Um, really, really shy. And the singing was the only thing that kind of got me out of my comfort zone. I was always like, not anti-social, but um, yeah. If it wasn't for the singing, I'll probably still be shy. Like, it took me a long time to come out of my, my shell, you know? I know, it probably doesn't show, like, in my performances, because I'm a totally, totally different person, but um, I still, to this day, I don't like to be filmed. I don't like to be filmed. That's why I'm having anxiety over fr next Friday. All right, look how cute. Oh my God, I love it. Stinking cute. I have like a hundred and thousand more to go. <laughs> but look how cute guys. Aren't they adorable? Oh my God, I love it so much. All right, let's try to, let's pick a different one because it looks like I'm doing a lot of Bohemian. That's like my thing. Like I said, I love jewel, jewel tone colors. Use a coffee one. I'll find a way to turn that into a bohemian style too. All right, here's some I gotta. Oh, um, Tina, I'm a professional singer, um, wedding singer, I'm a band leader. I have my um my own band called Xena's Mood Swings, but we haven't been playing since COVID. So 
I've been doing a lot of acoustic uh, gigs, but very little to none. And so next week I am filming with a wedding band. We're doing a video. It's not even my band, the band that I'm in my in with my boyfriend. We're, you know, he has his own wedding band that I'm in. And so we have a few weddings coming up in the summertime. And that was gonna be my the my next video before this one. This was like a last minute thing. Um someone just happened to ask me to fill in for another female singer. And so I figured let me just do it because you never know. And they're they have clients that are looking at the band. So, you know, I'm lucky to for them to have asked me. And yeah, I'm really not really looking forward to doing the video. <laughs> Mind you, I only have like three songs to sing. And they're not hard. They're not really showcasing my voice. That's my only down. Like, I'm not really happy about that. Like, I'm singing a Fleetwood Mac song, which I love Fleetwood Mac. She's part of my acoustic uh, set list. But, um, like, Dreams does nothing for me. Like, Dreams is just straight through, you know. I'm more of a soulful R&B type of singer. But it's fine. So, it is what it is. I can't complain. As long as they, you know, when it's time to book me and give me work, that's all that matters. And I'll just, you know, sing my best when it comes to doing this video. Yeah, Fleet, I mean, you know, Fleetwood Mac, like she, I do, I actually do a few of her songs. There's one song that I love called, um, uh, oh my God, it's a ballad. Oh, I'll think of it. Just give me a second. Songbird. That song I love to sing. Someone redid it and I like her vision, version. But um, yeah, this, I, I do a few Fleetwood Mac songs. But I do it on my acoustic set. Not with my not with my band. Like my band is more funk and R&B and some pop, you know. And some classic, uh, classic R&B. Like Gladys Knight and Aretha. Like that's my my kind of uh, stuff. Guys, I'm sorry with this glare. I don't know how to move it. Let me see something. I'm trying to. Okay. I wonder if I can move the the lamp a little bit. Oh, thank you, Tina. I mean, I'm a well-rounded singer. I sang with an Italian-American band for 10 years, so I had to learn how to sing in Italian. Um, I'm Puerto Rican, so I sing Spanish. So, you know, I've had to sing everything across the board. <laughs> That's one thing I have underneath my belt. Like, I, I'm a very experienced singer, performer, so... It's fun. I enjoy it. I do. I really do miss it. I do. I miss it a lot. I like that somewhere, somewhere there. I don't know. Oh. But this is better because you could kind of see the coffee in the background. <clears throat> Yeah, I have a, Jen, I have a YouTube, I mean, not a YouTube, but I have an Instagram too. It's called Zena's Mood Swings of my band. And I think, I think you follow me on my Facebook page, but I haven't really been posting anything on there. So All right, what to do? I'm stumped on this one. Because I don't want to cover 
up the words, the word coffee. Kofifi. I don't know where I got that from. That came from somewhere. I just don't remember. Oh, look at this cute little butterfly. I could put that there somewhere. You give me butterflies. I love it. Okay, I need something else though. I need another layering piece. We're just layering here, guys. That's all. What else? No, I don't know. Oh, look at this. I don't even know where I got this from. It's denim tags. Oh, I should back put these onto cardstock and make uh, altered paper clips. How cute. They already have the eyelets in them. Oh, I kind of like this better. I want to like pull that blue that's there. <clears throat> I don't know. Oh, I have some. Sorry. I want that a little bit longer, I think. <clears throat> I wonder why I just put it off to the side. Now, do I put this butterfly on there? <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. no. Hmm. Okay, I found something. I think little black peak, like you know, showing in the background there. I need some fabric type. This is crazy. I mean, it's still working. It's just super gooey. And I put um, acetone. I've added to it, but it's still, is it supposed to be like that? I don't even know. <clears throat> I 
it. I want to put something in there. Where are my stickers? Where are my stickers? Where are they? Mm. Oh, Jen, yeah, look. These are the, the stamps. I tried some out. They're pretty. From the dollar. You guys, these are from the Dollar Tree. All right, where am I going here? Right? Aren't they cute? Oh, let me move down. Say, so, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay, this is better. Yeah. <laughs> I really love this one with the birds. And then I picked up these pretty stickers. They remind me of like they, I don't know, boho. Very boho-y. Jeweled. All right. Um, what's a Tombow? Is that a, a marker? Sounds like a marker or something, if I'm mistaken. The stamps are not at my store yet. There are no stamps. Oh. Uh, yeah, I just, Vanessa, I was there last week and picked up some of the, the, the laser cut, like, wood or chipboard. So pretty. Like, hey, I'll show you. Look how pretty. And they didn't have them the week before that. And then this week I went and they had more things. Look how cute. Ooh. Oh, Tombow. Oh, okay. Oh, I got to check it out. But um, this week they had more things. So, and they had extra other paper pads and 12 by 12. So, you gotta like check every week there. <laughs> oh, should I do a pearl? I think this needs a pearl, a flat back pearl. Oh, well, they should come out with it soon. It looks like everyone's like behind. I know they're coming out with the metal die. I feel like this needs more than one, more than one pearl, maybe like three pearls going down the middle. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think, guys? <laughs> or one. Is one good? Or three? I think maybe one. Can't really see it. Oh my god, this is annoying me, the stream yard. <laughs> yeah. Dream yard, you need to get your act together. Seriously. Seriously. Get your act together. I know this is a free streaming service, but just because it's free doesn't mean that it has to be low quality. Like, seriously. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go with the one. I think three is too much. I like just in the middle. It's simple, but pretty. Oh, oh, really, Vanessa? I never thought, like, I don't think to, like, go on, like, the website at all. <laughs> oh. All right, I need to put some ribbon. We need some ribbon. All 
All right, anyway, what time is it? Oh God, it's, I've been on here for what, an hour already? I'm probably not gonna be on for too long, much longer, so. What do we got? What do we have here? Oh, this is cute. Here we go. You see, everyone else would throw these scraps out. Not I. <laughs> Oh, I don't like that little end sticking out though. Oh, that's where they sewed it together. Let me try to cut it. thinking cute 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 i can't wait to try out my new tea strainer all right i think i'm just gonna leave this like this this is fine this is fine How many did I make? I just made three. Is that all? Is that all I made? <laughs> I talk too much. <laughs> These little things are like, what? How how big are they? Let's see. Oh man. They're like a little over two and a half. Oh, maybe two and a half. Yeah, a little over two and a half, these little tags. <laughs> oh, she said that they have um, on Dollar Tree, their website, that they have all the items listed on the website. Oh, I have this one too that I didn't finish. Cause I thought I want, I was going to be fancy and uh, stamp it out with my Martha Stewart punch, but it's too small. So what I need to do is before I, I use the tab punch, I should punch out the paper first. Let's see, let's try something. We're going to be, let's try one more thing. And then I could call it a night guys. I know it's, I've been here for a while. Like, this is cute, this paper. Parisian paper. Let me just try this out first. These things are expensive. These, this, I paid money for this. I think I paid full price for these things. Maybe I used like a coupon at Michael's, but these are never on sale. 
let me tell you, they get you. I never see the punches or stamps on sale at Michael's. Let's try this real quick. Just experimenting. Oh, that might not work. Oh, if I, okay, hold up. Like that, I'm gonna have to. Oh, that's not bad, oh well. That's cute though. I was curious. Might as well punch the rest of it out. Okay. Okay, one more. I'll do one more and then I'll call it a night. <laughs> one more. One more time. Mm. I was supposed to make chili today in the crock pot and I didn't. I got lazy. Like, who says that? Who says, like, that's the easiest thing to do is just to throw everything in the crock pot. But, um, <laughs> oh my God, I didn't do it. Instead, I ate leftovers. This is from a boho, a little boho book, boho tag thingy. I don't know. A little, I don't know where it is. It's real small. It's like a three by five, I think. Paper pad. What are you guys eating for dinner? I know some of you are behind uh, you're t behind me in time. It's like 8.30 now. Well, it is 8.30. It's not like it is. That's cute with the little fringe. Mickey D's. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, I haven't had McDonald's in a long time. Oh, okay. Oh, is he okay? I have more scraps, guys. <laughs> Actually, this is ribbon. Sorry, ribbon that I got from Etsy. Ooh, fancy. 
fancy. That didn't work. I'm trying to make a string out of this, like a so I could put it in the, tie it around the tag. Let's see what else I got here. <clears throat> here we go. Look, do you think I don't like boho or jewel tone? Get out. Are you serious? Can he breathe? You don't have a rapid testing by you? This one. Oh, I don't like that one. <clears throat> yeah, like that. Oh. Oh, no, I hope he's okay. Let's just hope it's not COVID. You know, it's just a bad cough. Um, Jen, I don't know if you're into like that whole like whole food holistic stuff, but I always um, when I have a cold, which is very rare, but when I do and I have to sing. I make, um, I go to Whole Foods and I buy uh, organic turmeric, ginger, and then I boil them in water, lemon juice, honey, cinnamon, a little bit of lemon, and a little bit of black pepper because you need the black pepper to absorb the turmeric. And I'm telling you, it helps with inflammation Curry tea. Girl, she said we have curry tea. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to work. <laughs> oh, I kind of like these colors all together. Yes, I'm going with it. I'm telling you, everyone swears by this. My, uh, I used to work for a girlfriend of mine who was also a professional singer. Um, she was selling LuLaRoe online. And I was her assistant. And so she had to sing outside one time and she had a severe cold. This was last, this is actually last winter, right before this whole COVID mess started. And uh, she was like, I don't know. She was like so upset. She didn't know what to do. I'm like, girl, I got you. So I made her that concoction and she had to sing a Mariah Carey song. She's like, I do not know what you did, but it helped me. Oh, I put this, oh no, I got it. Well, let me just do this here. This, oh my God, this glue. I need a new glue. This turmeric and curry. Yeah, but you need the ginger and turmeric together. And you need all the other stuff, like the honey, the lemon, all that other good stuff to help for 
to help the cough, actually. I don't know which is the right way. It'll help coat your chest. What? The Nassau found bone, bones on the moon? What the heck? No, is that, is that a joke, Vanessa? Oh, <laughs> I'm like, what happened? Did I miss something? <laughs> oh, I don't know why I like this one so much. Ooh. That's going there. The cute little butterfly, guys. Look how cute. Look how pretty that is. I feel like my, my camera is so far away. And I'm off to the side because I had to turn my camera sideways. Ugh. I'm sorry. I don't mean to complain. I'm glad you guys are on with me. <laughs> I want this one. Use up your scraps. Use up your scraps. I mean, who does, like, who does, well, I just ripped that, but who saves these little things? I do. I do for stuff like this. So stinking cute. Alrighty, so that's it. I think that's it. I'm not going to be here. I, I mean, I could be here all night because I just don't sleep. <laughs> so. I love it. Love, 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 love. Um. Right? Aren't these cute? Let's see. What do we do? Let's show you. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Um, I'm glad I made you laugh a little bit. <laughs> Thank you for joining me on my first stream yard live on YouTube. <laughs> and um, I hope you have a good night. I'll probably catch you later on Daisy's on Daisy's live. But um, I hope you enjoyed this. You know, you just use up all your scraps. Very easy. You know, 
be sassy in your crafting. <laughs> All right. So good night, guys. All right. How do I just stop this? This is going to be the challenge. Thank you, Vanessa.